All right, guys, welcome back. This is Bad Senator. So, I would just like to start this episode with a little something. I am considering discontinuing this series, not because I'm not enjoying it, because I think this it will take an unreasonably long amount of time. Like, I think I, mean, I wouldn't be surprised if we're still in the first eighth of the series, even though we've been doing it for about two months now. So. I want you guys to weigh in. Would you rather I make more other content, like more episodes of Extreme Survival or other Minecraft maps? Or do you rather I um, keep doing Roblox Survival? If you have anything um, to say, just tell me in the comments. And if you have anything you want to say that might improve this channel, then I am all ears to that. Anyway, let's make a shield. Oh crud, we already have a shield. <laughs> Oops. Anyway. Okay, now we're looking... We're going through all the rooms, and I'm seeing if we... I got all... Like, I wonder if we ended up putting all of the, um, things that we had on us. I wonder if there was any monument blocks we had that were... Um, kill in the Enderman attack, you know? I got all the blocks I could get from up here. Oh, I just realized I am on low health. Let's make some mushroom soup, actually. Oh, it's, that's a mushroom block. That's one of the stuff we need we needed for the monument. So we're going to be putting that on really soon. I'm quickly realizing, though, I'm hungry, and I think this mushroom soup is going to be the best way to go about not being hungry. All right. Let's make that mushroom soup. Yummy, yummy. Alright. Cool. Alright, there should be enough for three. Which should quench... Quench, or... Satisfy me. Alright, here we go. Okay. Mushroom. Okay, here's the monument room, and now we can put our mushroom block on, which is cool. Mushroom block. Okay, let's get ready to put that on. Mushroom block. Where's the mushroom block? Oh, there's the mushroom block. We did it. We got another thing on our list. That's, um, eight down and many more to go. Anyway, let's have some more mushroom soup because we're still a little bit low on health. Keep this down there. Destroy the tree. Hold down left click. I wonder what that is. Um, what's that? Never seen that before. That's interesting. Alright. This is the room of death. This is the room that we died in. Let me just see if there's anything I got here that could be useful to us. No, nothing in here, but this is the Enderman room, which- Oh, dang it. That scared the living. You know what out of me. Skeleton hiding right there. There we go. Good, very good, very good. Let's make some torches, because it's kind of dark in here. Bing. There we go. Let's go into this room now. That's a creeper. This is the creeper room, I think. Let's seal that off. I don't want any of that creeper stuff. Looks like it is raining. I want to build a bridge over there. I want to, like, I don't think if we can get past this room, there might be something new over here. Mm-hmm. 
I don't know what is over there. Well, it's not new, though, because I can see we dig under there. Right, so I think we've got everything on the second floor. So now we gotta check out the third floor. Now, I'll be honest, I am kind of scared about this, what awaits us on the third floor, because I heard that that one's the hardest floor. Okay. Is that a creeper? It is a creeper. Oh, oy vey. Well, let's eat more. Oh, wait, carrots. Oh, yes, carrots means good. Carrots. Yummy carrots. Those are a good food source, too. There's like mobs coming out of really nowhere. Well, that's where they're coming from. That'll stop them. That'll show them who's boss. Never a dull moment in this Rubik's Cube, that's for sure. Alright. Looks like down there we got ourselves another room. So I don't know what's in that room, but I hear slime. And slime is obviously not something that I would consider to be good. Let's see what's happening. Oh no, this world is silver for sure coming from, probably. Oh, we finally found the, um, what's been causing our silverfish problem. This is what's happening. Now, I want to put up another block down there. Alright, so I'm going to come at it from this top, the top right here. And hopefully the solar fish won't be able to find a way to me. And then we can get rid of the silver fish. Nope, that's not gonna do it. Come on, the last thing I need is a solar fish to spawn on here. Come on, solar fish. Just don't spawn on here. Just treat me with mercy for once. Come on. Yay, we did it. We finally gotten rid of those dang silver fish. But, I also have a strange feeling that these are all silverfish blocks. In fact, let me see that. Yep, they're silverfish blocks. Because they're taking a rather long time to mine. Looks like we got another, um, one over there. Another silverfish spawner. So let's make our way over there. Alright. We're making our way over to the other silverfish spawner, and we're... Going to mine it. Like, we're gonna destroy it. Like, it destroyed the other one. We're gonna shoot silverfish. Like, no, no mercy to these silverfish. Because these silverfish have caused us so much angst that they deserve it, kind of. I just don't wanna fall in there, because that'd be very bad. Is that silverfish? Yeah, it is a silverfish block. These are all silverfish blocks. Or silverfish blocks. So that means that if I go in, then the whole floor is basically going to be crawling with silverfish. And that is actually pretty terrifying now that I think about it. But anyway, we're here for the blocks. And let's see if there's any blocks in this specific room that we need. I think we need pumpkin. There's pumpkins right there. Let me just double check. Check. Well, anyway, I think those pumpkins has got, have got to be there for a reason. No? So let's start making our way over to the pumpkins and let's mine the pumpkins. Great. Got the pumpkins. Cool. Now, we're gonna look for Jack O' Lantern on the monument blocks, because I'm pretty sure it's there. It's just not on my list for some reason. Oh, crap, I almost fell in. That would have been a disaster. All right, we've survived the cursed silverfish room. All right, let's make our way to the monument room and place our jack-o'-lantern. All right, 
We got the pumpkin. Let's make the jack-o'-lantern with the torch. There we go. Jack-o'-lantern. Alright. And portal frame, enchanting table, lapis block, quartz block, soul sand, pumpkin. Oh, we just need a pumpkin. Oh, okay. No need to do that whole jack-o'-lantern business. Maybe there is jack-o'-lantern, though, so let's take a look. Jack-o'-lantern. Is there a need for a jack-o'-lantern? Nope. Well, I mean, I guess it's a good light source. So there we go. We got pumpkin. Let's cross that off our list. Now that I see it. All right, we're doing pretty good, making pretty good progress, I think. Hopefully. Do we dare enter the creeper room? Nah, let's not risk entering the creeper room. Let's enter this room right here. Hopefully this is the Enderman room. Because that'd be bad. But thankfully, we're like, Endermen are three blocks tall. So they technically can't attack me in only a two block shaft like this one. We're mining. Let's just get the lantern. Put some light on the subject. Is there some stuff beneath? Yep, there is stuff beneath. I had a feeling I was digging over it somehow. Alright, let's get some actual light in here. Alright, torch. Looks like we got a, some kind of spawner down there, although I don't know what it is. We're going to do the old grapple technique where we... Do this. And now we can kind of in safely investigate what this room's all about. And that's a skeleton, so we are um, going right out of that place, because then I can be shot down into the magma cubes, and that is definitely something that I do not want to happen. I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of good stuff in that room. I just have a stark feeling. Is nether, is nether brick on the monument list? Because I just encountered some. No, I don't believe so, but I definitely think there's going to be quartz in this room. Because it's the nether. Or it looks like it's nether based, so... Based off of that assumption, there's going to be some good stuff in this room, I think. down. Now my plan is I'm trying to get under this room and we can take out the spawners from underneath. That's the idea. All right. There we go. Looks like we got ourselves a magma cube. All right, let's dig under. Got some soul sand. I think soul sand might be one of the um, monument blocks, so we'll keep that in mind. Right. What are we doing? I'm trying to find the spawner, and that's what we're doing. So. I'm trying to find the spawner that is spawning whatever. The magma cubes, probably. It's probably the magma cubes. I think I see the spawner, maybe. No, that's just a magma cube. Alright. Oh, there's the spawner. That was a lucky find right there. We got rid of that spawner. Now we gotta attack these magma cube guys. Safely. There's also some skeletons in here, so I don't want to just see where I jack it into this room. I want to take care of some of these guys first. Oh dear, I fell in. Oh. Taking some hits. Which is not good. Oh no, there's a that little guy right down there. Getting all up in my grill. Right. 
Alright, we are taking good care of these um, magma cubes, and by good care I mean killing them. Alright, good. This is good, we're conquering one of the other rooms up and I another a magma cube intrusion. I need more food, I want food, because food's gonna be important. As we take on these um rooms. You can't take on a dungeon room on an empty stomach, am I right? Well that's a bow, but we got magma cream. I mean magma cream. It's like ice cream, but it's lava. I mean, you're kind of burns the roof of your mouth, so it, I mean that's the drawback to it, but it's really good. I was probably running a little bit low on durability. Which isn't good. I think now that we killed the um um skeleton, maybe it's safe to go out there. Oh, there's a creeper there. Okay, good call. We didn't go out there. I would like to see if there's any more mob spawners. Because if there are any more mob spawners, then we gotta take those out too. We also need more food as well. We got We're running. We ran. Run out of food, which isn't good. I'm not seeing any um, more spawners right now. Let's just have a look past this um section of um what do you call it wall. Get some light in here as well. Oh, there's little guys. They're in the they're in the tunnel. Those guys are gonna be death of me. I know it. I do not see any more mob spawners, which is the positive. Oh, why don't you explode to explode your magma cube friends? All right, good. Now we block it up. So they can't get in here. Alright, good. We did a little bit of damage to them. Now let's say there's only a few left, which is good. I think we can it's now safe to enter this room. Alright, let's have a good look at this room. Oh! Ah!